remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel at NGN TV Nigeria. Click on the subscribe button and be the first to get notifications. Bayelsa State Governor Senator Doye Diri has assured Bayelsa that his administration will not rest on his laurels but will continue to implement programs and projects aimed at ensuring sustainable peace and development in the state. Senator Diri gave the assurance last week while reacting to the Supreme Court verdict that upheld his victory in the November 11, 2023 gubernatorial election in this state. He described the judgment as a triumph of truth over falsehood. After successfully serving his people for four years, Governor Diri was again re-elected governor of Bielsa State on November 11, 2023, having pulled a total of 175,196 votes to defeat his closest rival, Timmy Press Silva of the All Progressives Congress APC, who scored 110,108 votes. Dissatisfied with the outcome of the election, Silver approached the election tribunal seeking both the nullification of the entire electoral process and his declaration as the winner of the election. Unfortunately for Silver, the three-member panel presided over by Justice Adekunle Adeleye dismissed the petitions because neither Timipre Silver nor the All Progressives Congress APC provided credible evidence to substantiate their allegations of electoral fraud during the 2023 Bielsa state governorship election. Suffering the same fate at the Court of Appeal, the APC and its candidate headed to the highest court in the land. Unfortunately, the outcome could not be any better. The five-member panel of the APEX Court, led by Justice Lawal Garba, in a unanimous judgment affirmed the decision of the Court of Appeal. They agreed that Silver's appeal constituted an abuse of the court process and was lacking in merit. We are very happy that the appeal filed by Silver has been dismissed, having been found by the Supreme Court to amount to a gross abuse of court process. Reacting to the judgment, Senator Diri, who was in the company of his counterpart from Oshun State, Senator Ademola Adeleke, said it is a victory for the people's mandate and his administration would not rest but continue to work tirelessly to ensure that all Bielsons reap the dividends of the trust they have placed in him. This victory is not for me, it's not for my deputy governor, it is the victory of the people of Bielsa State. We already have the trust of the people and we will continue to do that which admit them to trust us. We will not disappoint them. The Supreme Court judgment was welcomed with cheers and celebrations in the state. These visibly excited women, including the Board of Trustees, member of the People's Democratic Party, Remy Kuko, expressed satisfaction with the Apex Court's decision. Our governor, Senator Noye Diri, they will continue to be governor. Nothing will trouble him. Anyone that trouble him, God, our God will chase them away. With this verdict, the coast is indeed clear for Governor Diri to consolidate his infrastructure transformation in the state, as well as continue marketing the oil-rich state on the international stage as a prime destination for investors. Inside the Niger Delta. 